level is awful. It's it's horrible. It's, it's like a room of challenges, and you're only halfway through the game. You don't even get any pleasure from losing. I I mean. I mean, you get no pleasure from losing. You feel like the game is cheating you because you've done everything you possibly can, even jumping over, which I am going to do right about you know, when we reach it, yeah. Okay, race, set, jump. You can jump on the shuttle! Nobody told me I could jump on the shuttle! I usually just jumped off the shuttle itself! Nobody told me I'm stuck to the shell so I can jump now. Who the heck? Oh my god! Oh god! Oh. oh my god! Nobody told me I could jump on the dang shell. And accelerating on the dang loop kills you! And that is why you never play Rayman, kids, because it doesn't explain the dang things! doesn't explain! EXPLAIN! <laughs> it's the only thing that I ask of this game! It didn't explain! Gosh, for the plums, it just told you everything right up, and originally for the shell... You know what, now they do for both at the same time, they gotta do accelerate and jump. What is wrong with this game? You should have told me! You should have told me I could jump on it. You told me that square boosts and X jumps off of it, and now for some odd reason, I don't jump off of it, I stay on the dang thing, and you know what, when you accelerate, you gotta accelerate in mid-air. Nobody told you that you can accelerate in mid-air. Okay, okay, like, sure, video games are okay if they don't tell you that you can hold down the jump button to jump. That's okay, because, you know, it's kind of like standard. There are no walking shells in any other video game, okay? There's never any time in any other video game, where, besides the original game of this, where you would actually use the, the shell to do stuff like this. Okay? Okay, now, first of all, this figure is weird. Oh my goodness! I jumped over the dang ledge that time! What more do you want? As soon as I pass this, I'm just gonna go... You know, I think this is really the only reason, the only part of the level which I honestly hate. It's just because that when you die, you gotta do the whole section again. And it's a huge section. How long have I been in... How long have I been in this section? I've been in there for like, two parts. There's one section. Now, I usually experience, I don't know, like, three loading screens a level. I've experienced one and... Oh, three loading screens in the part. I've experienced none of this part. And I think I'm going over the part. I have no idea. Why on earth do they do this?! Game is bogus! It made no sense how on earth I seem to get higher up! Okay, okay. And second of all, why is it that you randomly die? You randomly die! I don't even know what I was doing wrong then. 
So I jump off and I kind of do a turn around and suddenly, um... What the crap was going on? Fuck! <laughs> oh my god! I, I can't do it! I can't do it! I can't do it! It's too hard! I'm wondering if I do it this go! I, I can't do it! I can't do it! It's too frustrating! See, at least you get like three, four red lumps right there. Okay, did that, and I just got this one part which completely laughs in your face. Just like, oh wait, we're gonna do just like completely screw. Oh, automatic jump right there, just to. We're done! We're done! We're done! We're done! Oh god. <laughs> oh god. I hate you, Ubisoft, okay? I really hate you for that reason. You know what? It proves completely useful when it's like, oh. It's like, oh. So you, so you do that, and then suddenly... It's like, oh, uh, how do I get over there? Um, I definitely want, don't want to go back in there again. Uh, and then you jump down, and then you, re and then you realize you came back the way the way you came. Sure, you got a whole lot more cages and lungs, but when it comes to the possibly really annoying sections like that. They just throw it in. They don't give you any credit for that. They don't say, oh, well done. Here's some extra life for, for all those troubles. No. No, you just get all those lungs and familiar spirits. I don't care about the dang familiar spirits. I'm sorry. I'm just really aggravated by that section. You know what? For the rest of the level, now it's going to be boring. The other thing is that they do this thing where basically you gotta leave your plum. That, that sounds funny. You leave up. Oh. <laughs> I heard you were meant to leave your plum behind. Which you can also jump up here and actually fight that pirate in person. Or you can just get the cage. Nobody cares. Just cage. Oh, my right eye is watering because of the dang section. And now we got a random boss fight. Just and it's not the sanctuary boss fight. No, it's just a random thing that happens. Okay, do you want to know what it is? Oh, it's um. Uh, yeah. This guy, he just likes hiding away. If you got the rebound skill, it's okay, because, you know. You gotta not be facing him, though. And you killed him. Now, plum appears. You get your plum. You put it... Over here. Music keeps playing like there's still something there. We're out of here. Ugh! Freedom! You know what, I'm just gonna stop right there. I don't feel like doing any more after the dang rooms. I just really don't feel like it. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> Now, 
trying to get all these lums is impossible. Now, you can actually make yourself go up, back up the river. But trying to get these lums which just position on the dang wall. Plus, 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 there's two different types of lava. Oh crap! Yeah, the plum dies before you die. Yep. Why are they make a carrier? It's like. It's like they chuck it at me. New to Disneyland. Raymans. Sanctuary of stone and fire. <laughs> 